Is it good for the world to appeal to our credulity and not to our skepticism? Is it good for the world to worship a deity that takes sides in wars and human affairs? To appeal to our fear and to our guilt, is it good for the world? To our terror, our terror of death, is it good to appeal? To preach guilt and shame about the sexual act and the sexual relationship, is this good for the world? And asking yourself the while, are these really religious responsibilities, as I maintain they are? To terrify children with the image of hell and eternal punishment, not just of themselves, but of their parents and those they love. Perhaps worst of all, to consider women an inferior creation. Is that good for the world? And can you name me a religion that has not done that? To insist that we are created and not evolved in the face of all the evidence. Religion forces nice people to do unkind things and also makes intelligent people say stupid things. Handed a small baby for the first time, is it your first reaction to think, beautiful, almost perfect, now please hand me the sharp stone for its genitalia that I may do the work of the Lord. No. <laughs> we don't require divine permission to know right from wrong. We don't need tablets administered to us, ten at a time in tablet form, on pain of death, to be able to have a moral argument. No. We have... We have the reasoning, we have the reasoning and the moral suasion of Socrates and of our own abilities. We don't need dictatorship to give us uh, right from wrong, and that's my lot. Thank you.